Well, it has been a very busy week in the News Hounds newsroom. In fact, they moved into their brand new world headquarters this week. Now with instant video feeds from the Animal Planet and the zoo and the kitty cam, Esty and Lola have the animal world at their paw tips. We're not going to see this, are we? Here, Piggy Piggy, Lola says this could be an episode of the Keystone Cops. A pig escaped from a farm in Poland, and what ensued was a two-hour chase with the little porker having the upper hand. After two hours, they finally got him, and he went, you got it, wee, 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 all the way home. SD has more animals causing some trouble, or maybe it's a shepherd causing some problems he decided he had to move his flock to another field on the other side of the city. So he went right through the center of town. The shepherd, his son, and 60 sheep walked slowly for six miles. Drivers were not amused, some reportedly close to a nervous breakdown. Police tried to stop the madness, but left the man alone. In the end, they made it out of the city, much to the relief of all involved. Lola says some canoers got a very big surprise in the waters off Maui, and it's a trip this Arizona couple will never forget. They were paddling a few hundred yards offshore when a humpback whale came out of nowhere and bumped their canoe. No one was hurt, but a few nerves were frayed. This little guy is no NBA star, but Esty says he sure knows how to dunk. His name is Eddie, and he's a sea otter at the Oregon Zoo. Eddie's turning the ripe old age of 16 this year, and zookeepers say he suffers from arthritis in his elbows. They taught him to dunk last year to exercise his joints. The slam dunking sea otter has gotten so good at it, zookeepers say he rarely misses. Maybe they should change Eddie's name to LeBron. Finally, Lola says this is a good way to spend a day at work. Dog riding monkeys took over an Indianapolis TV station. The cowboy monkeys raced the dogs down the hallway. The female monkey won the race, but only because she cheated and didn't go all the way to the end of the hallway. The monkey's trainer says it takes a lot of love to get them to do this. Their treat? Pop-Tarts. Lola thinks the new world headquarters would be the perfect place for some dog riding monkeys. And that's this week's edition of the News Hounds. And they're getting a treat in the world headquarters as well. The treat alert. The treat alert is on. Oh, I need some monkeys there. <laughs> right. <laughs> well, we didn't get a chance to show it to you before, so now let's take another yeah, look let's, at it. Here's the brand new world headquarters for the News Hounds. There they go. They're there entering it is, in. Right at eye level, they got a kitty cam and a zoo cam and the animal planet feed, and they're monitoring 24 hours a day. Phones at the ready, treat alert going off. I wish everyone at home <laughs> could be there when the treat alert goes off. <laughs> and going to see, can you can sort of see it along the wall there. And, and shooting this was quite a chore. It took quite a while. We have a new appreciation for the puppy bowl yeah, after uh, trying to shoot this story. So we'll be seeing more of the world headquarters in the weeks to come. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you had a great weekend. Have a good one. We'll see you on Monday. Good night.